well. They're invisible, right? So Sharing is something we all hope our kids learn, but in a school setting, it comes with consequences. First graders at Treeline Elementary in Fort Myers are getting a lesson in hygiene. This program is called Germane the Germ, and the purpose is to teach kids about germs, hand washing, um, and just health in general, staying healthy throughout the year, because it's really tough sometimes, especially at a young age. There's all the yucky fake germs, right? Okay. Younger children are known for being touchy. In a classroom, almost everything is an opportunity to spread germs. I don't think that we think about it either. One person gets a cold and then everyone gets it and then it's kind of like okay for a while and then it'll happen a month later. This program is designed to leave an impression, a mark on students. In fact, a highlight is a demonstration using a glow lotion that shows up under UV light. Kids are able to see how germs spread from classmate to classmate. Yeah. Those are all the fake germs. Them being able to do it and touch the ball and see the light with the germs, I definitely think they're going to remember. I think that really gets them thinking, um, and I know I've heard from teachers, um, after I leave for the next week or so, they're really conscious about always washing their hands, touching things, and being careful about those germs that they're spreading. Simple yes, but studies show elementary schools can reduce colds and flus by teaching proper hand washing techniques. A 20 second scrub to wipe out a petri dish of possibilities. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher. We usually don't get to see this happen. Today we get to see it happen. How easily we spread those germs.